This product is IoT based advanced smart cradle for baby monitoring system. Here, hardware connection sir, Arduino and its data board along with power supply, system at two LCD display. Here, sound sensor, DHT11, temperature and humidity sensor, connected to Arduino digital pins. DC fan controlled by relay, which is connected to Arduino digital pin, and buzzer connected to Arduino digital pin. Here, Wi Fi model ESP8266 connected to Arduino yard port. We can see here, MEM sensor connected to Arduino and like pins respectively. Before going to start this project, initially we had created hotspot in our mobile with the username IoT server and password IoT server 123. Now we have to open hotspot settings. We can see here hotspot name IoT server and password IoT server 123. Okay. Mobile should have internet through the SIM. Here, using this sound sensor, when baby cries, then mic sensor detects and the cradle will swing with servo motor. And using this digital sensor, sense the temperature and the humidity surrounding of the baby. Here, using this ADC MEMS, when baby moves or tilt, MEMS sensor will identify and give signal to the Arduino. Then fan will be on. Here we can see, this is the for urine detection purpose. When urine comes, buzzer will be on. We have to place this mem sensor on baby. Now power on this. Wi-Fi connecting. We can see here in LCD, it is showing temperature and humidity surrounding of the baby. Here, whatever action happening here, in this data we can see in IOT server. Now we have to open IOT server application. We can see here it is asking username and password. Here username is IOT117 and password is IOT117. Now we will see the our project output. Here first we have to activate the sound sensor. It is crying. Here you means data upload into the IoT server. Now we will see the second condition. Here second condition is MEM sensor. Whenever baby moves or tilt then MEM sensor activated. In this data we can see in IoT server. We can see here baby tilt fan on. Here you miss data plugged into the IoT server.
now we will see the third condition here third condition is whenever baby bed wet or urination then birth will be on and this data we can see in iot server you can see here in lcd urine u means data applied to the iot server now we have to remove this now we have to open iot server we have to refresh this page we can see here temperature humidity urine status crying status and baby movement status with respect to date and time 